This is one of the few poems that I've written and I feel like this setting in and I'm gonna read it. Mostly I don't read it, but this one is perfect as it is, so I wanna leave it in its beauty. Um, this one is for my pudding, wherever he is and whoever he is. Hide behind charm and wisdom, let your kingdom come. Play melodic music with the ease of your touch. Silent to rub in between like a maiden and the first time she used her shelter <coughs> brush. But I don't mind because your eyes tell no lies. The treble in your voice gave away your past pride. Let me hold your pain. Let me feel the strength you gain. It's addictive to my needs. Show me your deepest hidden memories. The taste of your sins is so familiar to my tongue. Show me what the world has done wrong. Let me admire your stars because in my eyes, they glow like stars. I want to gaze at the heavens and feel your breath in the softest spots of my neck. It's only a disaster if you can't see the beauty in the wreck. Life of flame. You, the wood I need to burn. Without knowing it, you gave me so much in return. I wish I could give you my emerald stones just so you could see the beauty in your broken bones. You don't give away much detail, but I picked up on the silence in between your words. My heart even feels the unspoken words. I have become twisted in my cravings for you. A canvas, so empty but full with paintings the untrained eye cannot see. Let me tear off your clothes so I can set your mind free, intoxicate you with a breath and revive you with pleasure. I'll hide you in my collection as my most appreciated and loved treasure. <coughs> <laughs> and on the way, so what for inspiration is, I can do that like a potato. <laughs> Call me S. S is for seduction, but S can also be a deduction. S could be the strength that you call the witch in me. S could be the innocence that you see from the witch in me. What is a woman if not defined by strength and power? We were taught from the beginning to stand tall.